right now, because they paid so little price for the hack of the DNC and the DCCC, uh, there's little to deter them. I think naming them and shaming them is probably the best deterrent uh, that we could have, uh, along with sanctions, if those can be achieved. But, um, but the failing to even call them out on it, I think, merely invites uh, further disruptions like this. Well, President Obama had an opportunity to name them uh, a couple days ago. He was at a news conference on his during his Asia trip, but he declined to do so. He simply said experts say that Russia may be behind these hacks. Should he go farther, do you think? I think he should. What I should think he, he should. say? And I, I think, well, I think he should say, uh, I've examined the evidence. I've talked to the intelligence community about this. I'm convinced that the Russians uh, are behind uh, several hackings of our political institutions. This has got to stop. If it's pretty clear that Russia's behind these hacks and these various efforts, why don't we do more? What's the argument against taking more steps? Well, the argument against uh, may be twofold. Uh, it may be, I uh, hear Secretary Kerry has been trying to work with uh, Lavrov of Russia to reach an agreement on Syria, and he may be concerned about the impact that naming and shaming Russia on the cyber hacks will have on those negotiations. Uh, the other factor, though, the administration may be considering is, would it look too political for them to come in and say the Russians are hacking, they're trying to influence our political process? Would they be uh, considered or would it give the appearance they were trying to tip the scales for Hillary Clinton? So we'll see the dumping of further information. There's some dumping of information now going on even in congressional uh, campaign races. Uh, so I think we're just seeing the beginning, and it won't even end in November either. Uh, I think unless there's a strong pushback, uh, and I think the administration really needs to call out Russia on this, make public attribution. Uh, that right now, there's no price to be paid by the Russians for this kind of meddling. We know they have the capability to hack into some of our state's Secretary of State's offices. We know at least two states have been the subject of hacking already. Uh, so the question is not whether they have the ability, only whether they have the will to do it.